All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is Sports Dom coming back with another video. And this is my Arizona Diamondbacks at Baltimore Orioles Game 3 recap. So the Arizona Diamondbacks with a big blowout win over the Baltimore Orioles 9-2. to uh, The Arizona Diamondbacks improved to 19-22 and on the season. The Baltimore Orioles fall to 26-13. The Diamondbacks had nine runs, eight hits, two errors. The Baltimore Orioles, two runs, four hits, two errors. The Diamondbacks had a six-run sixth inning uh, to win nine to two. They had a two-run fifth and a one-run fourth. Uh, so, in the top of the fourth, Christian Walker uh, hit a sacrifice fly for the RBI. Corbin Carroll scored, and it's one nothing Diamondbacks. And then in the top of the fifth, uh, Orioles challenged a force play call uh, the, on the field. Was upheld. Corbin Carroll reached on a fielder's choice, uh, fielded by third baseman Ramon Urias. E. Eugenio Suarez scored, which sent Newman to third, Barnhart to second, and it's 2 nothing Diamondbacks. And then Cattell Marte hit a sacrifice fly for the RBI. Uh, Kevin Newman scored, sent tenor, Tucker Barnhart to third and Corbin Carroll to second. And it's 3-0 Diamondbacks. And then they, uh, the, in the bottom of the fifth, the Orioles made it 3-1. Jordan Westberg, his ninth double of the season for the RBI. Uh, to left fielder Lloyd Escario Jr. Anthony Santander scored, and it's 3-1 Diamondbacks. And then Jake McCarthy hits a two-run home run, his first home run of the season. We've been waiting for it. We know the power is there. And uh, he hits his first home run of the season on a fly ball to right field. Lloyd Escario Jr. scored, and it's 5-1 Diamondbacks. And then Cattell Marte uh, singled on a ground ball to right fielder Anthony Santander. Kevin Newman scored. Tucker Barnhart scored. Uh, so it's a two-run RBI single for Cattell. Or it's, yeah, two-run RBI single for Cattell. Corbin Carroll to third. Marte to second. And it's 7-1 to one Diamondbacks. And then Randall Gritchick, an RBI double. Uh, on a fly ball to left fielder Ryan O'Hearn. Corbin Carroll scored. Cattell Marte scored. And it's 9-1 to Diamondbacks. So they had the bats going today and were scoring runs today. They didn't want to get swept. And then in, in the bottom of the sixth, Edley Richmond hit a solo home run on a fly ball to right field. 9-2. to Diamondbacks win. Zach Gallen gets the win. He's 5 and 2 with a 2.86 ERA and uh, Dean Kramer falls to 3 and 3 with a 3.72 ERA. So, let's recap this. Corbin Carroll had 5 at bats. He had 2 runs, 2 hits, no RBIs, no walks, 1 strikeout, has a .201 average and a .8 or in a .553 OPS. So, it, it, he got his bat working today. Cattell Marte uh, had four at-bats. He had one run, one hit, three RBIs, no walks, two strikeouts. Has a .293 average and a .885 OPS. Jack Peterson had two at-bats. He had no runs, no hits, no RBIs, one walk, two strikeouts. Has a .292 average and a .931 OPS. Randall Gritchick had two at best. He had no runs, one hit, two RBIs, no walks, one strikeout. Has a .281 average and a .738 OPS. So, and then Christian Walker had four at best. He had no runs, no hits, one RBI, no walks, three strikeouts. Has a .265 average and a .818 OPS. So, we got to get Christian going again. Uh, Lourdes Guerrero Jr. had four at-bats. He had one, one run, no hits, no RBIs, one walk, two strikeouts, has a .239 average and a .664 OPS. So, got to get him, keep 
keep it up too. Eugenio Suarez had four at bats. He had one run, one hit, no RBIs, no walks, two strikeouts, has a point two two three average and a point six three eight OPS. Jake McCarthy had four at bats. He had one run, one hit, two RBIs, no walks, no strikeouts, had the home run and uh has a point two nine three average and a point seven six eight OPS. Kevin Newman had three at bats. He had two runs, two hits, no RBIs, one walk, no strikeouts. Has a point two one six average and a point six two five OPS. That's good. He's up over two hundred going into this game. I think he had like a one point eight or one point nine three or something like that, or point one nine three or something like that. So that's good. Tucker Barnhart had two at-bats. He had one run, no hits, no RBIs, two walks, one strikeout, a .205 average, and a .610 OPS. So we'll see if they can keep it going against Cincinnati. Uh, the totals for the Diamondbacks, they had 34 at-bats, nine runs, eight hits, eight RBIs, five walks, 14 strikeouts, and win 9-2 to in Game 3 in Baltimore. Zach Gellin went six innings, allowed four hits, two runs, two earned runs, two walks, four strikeouts, one home run, has a 2.86 ERA. Uh, Matt Bowman, who we acquired recently from the Minnesota Twins, looked good. Uh, he went two innings, allowed no hits, no runs, no earned runs, one walk, one strikeout, no home runs, and has a 2.38 ERA. And then Justin Martinez came in and went one inning, allowed no hits, no runs, no earned runs, one walk, no strikeouts, no home runs, and has a 0 0.77 ERA. Uh, the totals, the Diamondbacks pitchers, nine innings, allowed four hits, two runs, two earned runs, four walks, five strikeouts, one home run, and the Diamondbacks with a big blowout win over the Baltimore Orioles improved to uh, 19 and 22 on the season the Baltimore Orioles fall to 26 and 13 on the season and the Diamondbacks win 9 to 2 they needed that win and in game one of the Cincinnati series tomorrow uh, it looks like it's going to be Graham Ang Ashcraft on the mound for Cincinnati, he's 3-2 and two with a 3.86 ERA, 32 strikeouts. And Jordan Montgomery for the Arizona Diamondbacks, he's 2-2 two and two with a 4.70 ERA, 10 strikeouts. So the Diamondbacks, uh, got to get him some run support early uh, and often. The last time we faced Cincinnati, which was last week, we swept them. Uh, so we want to uh, win that series again. Uh, so it'll be Graham Ash Ashcraft versus Jordan Montgomery on the mound in game one of that series. Let me see if uh, they say who's going to pitch in game two. <clears throat> sometimes they have the full series uh, pitching matchup. Sometimes they don't. Uh, but we will see uh, if they do for game two. Uh, hopefully they do. And uh, in game two, it's going to be Hunter Green for Cincinnati. He's 1-2 with a 3.38 ERA, 53 strikeouts. Against Slade Sacconi for the Arizona Diamondbacks, he's 1-2 with a 4.15 ERA, 17 strikeouts. And uh, let's see if they have game three. <coughs> and it'll be... Uh, Abbott for Cincinnati. Andrew Abbott for Cincinnati in Game 3. He's 2-4 and four with a 3.35 ERA, 37 strikeouts. And Brandon Fott for Arizona. He's 1-3 with a 4.60 ERA, 42 strikeouts. So, uh, I feel comfortable. Um, it's going to be tough to sweep them again, but... Uh, we are the home team. Take game one, and we'll work from there. Uh, but a good, you know, we should have won game two in, in Baltimore uh, that went 11 innings. We gave up a 4-2 uh, lead late, and we should have won this series two games to one. But Baltimore, 
they have a very good baseball team uh, and you know they they were the better team in this series but we we should we should have won game two um, and then uh, we play Cincinnati like I said Monday Tuesday Wednesday then we get a day off then we're home against Detroit for three and home again or at the Dodgers for three and then we get the day off so uh, and then we end May against the Marlins Rangers and Mets so guys comment in the comment section below on what you think and as always if you like my videos like subscribe and hit that bell notification so you don't miss a video this is sports dom peace go diamondbacks let's beat the cincinnati reds they're going to be pissed off and they're going to want to beat us uh, we beat them tuesday wednesday thursday uh of last week so they're going to want to beat us and now we play on monday tuesday wednesday uh but we're going in on a winning we're going into that series on a winning note and uh let's just win game one uh get the bats going keep the bats going and uh let's at least take game one and then we will worry about game two uh on tuesday so like I said, comment in the comment section below on what you think. And as always, if you like my videos, like, subscribe, and hit that bell notification so you don't miss a video. This is Sports Dom. Peace. Go Diamondbacks. Let's beat Cincinnati. And uh, let's win another series. Uh, we have four series wins, eight series losses, and a series split. Uh, we are 19 and 22 on the season. And uh, let me see what uh, the Cincinnati Reds uh, come in at. Uh, it should say it here. Uh, the Cincinnati Reds are 17 and 23, with three of those losses coming to the Arizona Diamondbacks. Uh, and the Diamondbacks are 19 and 22. So we want to win this series. I don't know if we'll sweep them again, uh, but we want to win this series. And then get ready for the uh, for the Detroit Tigers, who we swept last year. Uh, they are twenty and twenty. So guys, comment, like, subscribe. Go Diamondbacks! Let's beat the Cincinnati Reds.